Hi, my name is Marshall Lamb, and I handle the publicity for the Yerba Buena Gardens Festival. This is the third year I've been involved with the festival and involved with the wonderful people here at the gardens. Marshall, you've been in the music business a long time and represented many cultural organizations. What makes this place different? Uh, this place is different because they're, all the events are free and open to the general public. They're all ages. Uh, there's a good cross-section of people that come here um, on a regular basis. And if you just look at the, 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 the scenery here at the gardens and all the wonderful you know, different programs that are offered here in the gardens, aside from just the festival, it's such a great destination for people in San Francisco, people from out of town, for families, for youth groups, student groups, all sorts of people. So it's a wonderful destination here in San Francisco to learn about the arts and culture and, you know, come, on, come with your family and, and hang out in, a, in such a beautiful setting. Now, you used to uh, work with Yoshi's and you know good music, don't mm -hmm. you? Uh, so what have been some of your favorite acts over the last few years here? Um, I enjoyed, uh, you know, when Maraca from Cuba came, I thought that was a wonderful show. Uh, the Marcus Shelby Jazz Orchestra, one of my favorite groups. Um, you know, the dance uh, presentations that happen here I think are really fantastic. Uh, the San Francisco Theater Festival, you know, Israel in the Gardens, you know, in the past when they've done the San Francisco Ballet or the San Francisco Symphony, all those are such wonderful events. This year, the tribute to Hilton Ruiz in October uh, is an event I'm really looking forward to, so hopefully we'll see everybody out for that.